Hi there, Marlena here from AppendantOfPurpose.com and in this video I'm going to show you how to make more stable lines in Procreate. So this series has been on how to make straight lines in Procreate and this will help with straight lines, but I also think it's awesome for doing things like lettering. So when you letter with a brush, sometimes it can come off as kind of wobbly. Now this brush, I don't remember if it has streamline on. Um, yeah, kind of, okay. You can see it's, it's a little bit wobbly though. Now let's say I want this to be a lot more nicely done like calligraphy. I'm going to go into my wrench icon, my prefs menu up here, and then pressure and smoothing. And I already have some stabilization on there. So let me turn that all the way off and then I'm gonna show you what it would look like if I wrote without stabilization on. It's pretty similar, but that makes sense because I only had it on about 26%. Cab. So now I'm gonna go back in there, hit pressure and smoothing, and I'm going to stabilize it, let's say up to 50%. And I'm gonna show you what that'll do. So I've lost some of the kind of waviness in my L's because it's it's really stabilizing that. It's harder for me to be wobbly. So let me just see if I can show you the difference. It's really hard to show you. I think you need to practice this yourself to see it. So if I were to turn stabilization off, you know, everything's going to draw as I draw it. And I'm going to go and I'm going to really crank it up this time. <laughs> crank it up to max. I'm not going to be able to do anything. Do you see how it's not even letting me? It's so stable that I just can't even do anything. So I don't know why you would ever use that, <laughs> but I'm sure there's a reason. So I'm going to turn it back down to 50%. And I can still do this. Do you see how it's almost like I, it's so much easier for me to do the thicks and thins though. This is very stable in general. This is great for doing calligraphy actually. Now, if you don't wanna do that, the way that I was doing that is stabilizing all of my brushes. And I think I had it at like 28% before, so I'm gonna put it back. But let's say that I don't want to do that. I want to stabilize some of my brushes, but most, if I want to do drawing, I want it to be less fakey stabilized. Um, I would go into my actual brush and change the brush settings. I always will swipe it to the left, duplicate it, and then change the brush settings in the brush I duplicated, which is the one that'll have a one after it. Click on that and I'm in the brush studio and I can go to stabilization and let's, see here. Will it show? It's not going to show it on what's here right now. So I'm going to clear my drawing pad. So right now it's like this. So I'm going to increase the stabilization. It did show. So you can see it's increasing or decreasing that stabilization. So it got harder for me to um, kind of make a unstable line. Did you see that? So with this off, you know, I went into being very zigzaggy. With this up, doing the same thing and I'm not gonna get that, but it will help you to draw more consistent letters and stuff like that. Now, this is new in Procreate 5.2. What was happening before is you would get streamline and usually you'd have it up to 79% or so and get some really nice letters. I don't even know what I'm writing, but there it is. <laughs> so I keep trying to double tap. So I'm going to turn stabilization off. Streamlines up. If streamlines down, you can see again, it, it does change it slightly. So I'm going to click done and I'm going to delete that new brush I just made. So hopefully that is helpful for you just to know how you can stabilize a specific brush or all of your brushes across the board 
as I showed you, I do have some stabilization on my brushes, which I guess I've had for a while. I'm not real sure. So if you found this helpful, please remember to hit the like button and subscribe and leave me any comments of any other things you'd like me to show you in Procreate. I'd be happy to help out. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.